Uh, Vinny, back on the top of the table. How's that feeling? Uh, doesn't to be honest with you, it doesn't feel that much different than, than where we were at the start of the day. I think um, it's a boring enough answer, but we've been playing really well over the last sort of number of weeks. I think we've we've uh, 19 points out of 21, so we we've been consistently getting better all the time, and um, it's really. The, the top of the league doesn't mean the hell of a lot to us at the moment. I think uh, we've underachieved at times this year, and, uh, and we're starting to find our form and um, improve. And you know, we still got areas of improvement to come, but we're happy where we are. Obviously, after tonight. And just came here. Yes, only only one point separated yourselves and Bowes, and came here and get a, got a, a two 0 win without Patrick Cubin, your top goal scorer. You must have been really impressed with your team tonight. Yeah, I was very impressed. I, I thought the first 30 minutes we were outstanding. We probably, maybe 35, the last 10 minutes of the first half, we probably just dropped the intensity a little bit. Um, but um, Gary made an unbelievable save, and I think that changed the game as well. Um, it was an outstanding save. But um, look, they're a dangerous side. Um, they have a lot of good young players. Um, they're well coached, well drilled. So it was a difficult night for us, but I think we, we ran out worthy winners in the end. And Georgie Kelly came in and got his goal. How impressed were you about his performance? Um, like I've been really impressed with Georgie since the start of the season, and it's been difficult because um, you know he he's been understudied to Pat, and normally we'd like to make changes after in in this number nine position at a certain time or within a certain window, but we've had a lot so many injuries, and um, we've been taken off midfielders and centre halves, and he hasn't had as much game time as he probably deserves. So uh, George has been outstanding in training and that goal and that performance doesn't surprise us. He's, he's, he's ahead of where he was this time last year in terms of his fitness levels and it's starting to pay off from on the pitch. You started off really quickly and you're sort of pushing up really high on the Bows fullbacks. Is that something you isolated during the week as a place that you could cause a bit of danger? No, not necessarily. I think we like to press a lot of teams we play against. I think that's our, 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 our sort of style. So I don't think tonight was any sort of major different way of playing. Um, when we have everybody fit and when we're at it, I think we play with high intensity. And you've seen that tonight, we're getting closer to where we should be um, all the time. Like I said, top of the table again. Is that your show of intent now? Is that where Dundalk want to stay for the rest of the season? No, I don't see the top of the table as a major statement tonight in any way, shape or form. I think um, we're probably four, four to five points sort of worse off than I felt we should be. Um, so uh, with, with sort of the injuries and different things we've had, we feel like we've probably left four points behind us on the pitch. Um, and it's not really about who's top of the table at the moment. It's about us, you know, continue doing the right things. We've 19 points out of 21, as I said, so and we're in good form and we have to continue that. How do you maintain that then? How do you maintain the form that you've gathered over the course of the season and make sure that you actually do stay top of the table, even if it's not a priority? I think the key is that um, as players, as staff, we have to be obsessed about getting better and improving and um, we have to spend a weekend now working on already working on Cork and how we're going to play against them. For us, it's still one of the biggest games of the season. I know their form has dipped off. They'll be there waiting for us, and uh, so it's, a, it's probably the biggest game of the season so far for us heading down there. And um, we just have to be obsessed about getting better and improving all the time, and um, that's what we do, and we, we continue to work hard as a group.